What is going on guys? I'm Parker with PB Cars and we are back today after a long awaited time with uh, taking a break from car reviews. It has been super cold out here. We've been real busy with the holidays. Most of you understand, I assume. And so we're back with a 2018 Toyota Tacoma SR5 double cab. Now this also has a four wheel drive option as well. And the dealership we got this from has loaded it up with some TRD parts. We have a T-Bart <clears throat> we have the TRD, TRD shifter as well as the TRD 17 inch rims and they also loaded this up with a lift kit and some Nitto Terra Grapplers. So some great options from them. We'll go back into uh, a little bit of in depth with them here in a minute. But uh, first off, we want to start out with uh, happy holidays guys. It's, uh, it's been a while. Uh, shout out to uh, Guitar Mageddon ZL1. Nick, you're the best. Send it. <laughs> That's what we do here. So guys, this is magnetic gray on this 2018 Tacoma. We have quite a few changes that they've made to this, some really cool ones. And so we will jump right into it. All right guys, so we wanna also give a huge shout out to our sponsors, Seek Racing, which we will have merchandise coming real soon from him. He's gonna get us some shirts, some hats, some stuff like that going. And uh, we'll have a website going as well where you can purchase these things and uh, give us some support. So looking, looking forward to that all day, every day, of course. Shout out to him. And we can annotate something above to Instagram or something like that to him. And uh, also huge shout out to World Auto Society, uh, Strata App, and Garage Mino. All right, guys. So let's jump right into this front end. So for the 2018 model year, we have a redesigned grill, which looks super, super fantastic. We have aggressive body lines all the way around. This truck actually sits at the same height, if not higher, than most mid-sized trucks on the road. While we were out there driving, we, uh, we noticed that F-150s, uh, Silverados, we were actually a little bit taller than them. And I understand this is a six inch, well, not a six inch lift. Jesus. <laughs> and I do understand that this has a little lift on it with some bigger tires, but it's still rather large for a mid-sized truck in its class. So really cool stuff coming out of Toyota as usual. We love working with Toyota. Shout out to Watt Johnson Toyota. And uh, if you guys are looking for anything in the area of Clarksville or Tennessee region, uh, hit up Brian Corona. He is the guy we go through. He's a good friend of ours, and he will get you into one of these no problem. What? In Cent <laughs> Centra. Ooh, focus. That's what I'm talking about. Man, the car scene's lit today. i tell you what, boys. Even though it's salty. Yeah. Salt in the roads. 37 degrees. It's actually above freezing. That's a heat wave. Yeah, it's a I know. Heat That's wave today. It has been below freezing for the last week and a half. That's why we haven't been able to really come out here. Got snow in the forecast. Wanted to snag a couple of reviews for you Got guys. Three there. degrees on New Year's Day. That is right. <laughs> they, they were calling for eight to 11 inches of snow there for a little while, but we'll see what happens, I guess. Uh, you know, this is the perfect vehicle to have, though, when You're that comes right. around. This would be a blast. In the snow. Oh, yeah. You know, it's got the LSD, the 3.5 liter V6. Comes with LSD. Yeah. Comes with LSD. It's pretty nice. <laughs> yeah, you know, you, what kind of LSD are you talking about? <laughs> the differential. Okay, good. Me too. Duh. <laughs> That's really the only major difference up front for the 2018 model, but we have some chrome accent around the grill as well as this nice black finish on top of that, as well as the black finish on the bumper. It gives it super aggressive stance. A nice look overall. Uh, real nice for off-roading purposes. You have a really nice ride height to clear any rocks or debris in the way. It's quite a vehicle. It's definitely one of the best in the mid class, mid mid size truck class, I believe. If you pull that air dam off, that's right. You got you so have, much more. You got over half tire hitting. Oh yeah, that's amazing. Toyota really knows what they're doing with the uh, the TRD. Speaking of TRD, let's hop down to these 17 inch TRD rims with the 
black with the black and red center cap there. Now these are wrapped in 265-70R17 Nitto All-Terrain Terra Grabblers. Now this is a really awesome tire to have on this Tacoma. You can have this for off-road functions, road functions, you know, whatever. It's, it's a great all-around tire. It really is. And I would definitely recommend that to anyone who is looking for some uh, tires on your truck. Are those RevTech shocks? Yes, they are RevTech shocks. Oh, wow. Toyota really knows what's up when they design these things. Let me tell you what. And the dealer has also installed this side step here. Of course, made out of complete metal. Plastic. Yeah, that's plastic, all right. Just about broke my knuckles. <laughs> Now, like I said, this is an SR5 double cab four wheel drive, so it's not fully loaded. It's not a TRD Pro or anything like that, but it still has some really awesome features. Just like uh, one of the new things for 2018 is the safety sense. So you do have the safety sense in the base model Tacomas now. And uh, you get some really nice things coming out of Toyota. Like I say all the time, I love Toyota. Might own one one day, you know, if I can ever find a deal on an 86. <coughs> cough, cough. Brian. Brian. <laughs> No, you're watching this. All right, guys. So we also have trailer hitch from the factory, some more chrome alongside the bumper, and of course, the taco. <laughs> and the rear camera. That's right. There is a backup camera on here as well, which is really, really awesome. In the fact that this is an SR5, it is a base model. It's not, you know, a TRD package this or anything like, like that. From the base model. Yeah, I mean, it's it's pretty nice. It's, uh, you know what? It's okay. <laughs> Educate. It's okay. So we have a nice little bed liner that they've also installed here. Really, really cool coming from the factory. Now we do have these bed rails and all of that is in the back seat, which we can show here in a little bit, but you have the tie down for the rails back there. Comes included a uh, front license plate bracket, lots of awesome what stuff. These boxes, look at those. Let's see what's in these suckers here. What's that? I can't see. I guess it's tie down. Yeah, I guess it is tied up. I better not say what we think it is. It's, that won't be right. <laughs> or it's more storage. It's something like that. One of the two. But very usable back here. It's a very nice sized truck. I would definitely have one. Coming from a Colorado owner, I I love the Tacoma. I'd buy this over a new Colorado. Triggered. Triggered. <laughs> I would honestly like to see an off-road between the TRD Pro and the ZR2. Oh, I remember... CR2 is the most capable. Oh, well, you're the one that titled that one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I had to change it to a question mark because people got all tore up. Ah, well, I'm I'm a believer in the in, in the taco. I like the taco. I mean, this thing is nice. For a mid-sized truck, I think this definitely has what does the sticker a say nice again? market. I think it's 43, 43,000. I mean, like what they put on here. Hey. It's uh, 35793 before, and then they have installed uh, the TRD shift knob, TRD air filter, the uh, hmm. I wonder what all they have put on here, because it doesn't actually it doesn't even tell. say wheels or tires yeah, or they, anything. Well, they just got this truck. This was just delivered this week, and so they probably haven't had anything written down on it yet, but yeah. this this has been, they they installed the rims, the side step, and the tires, and all that, and the shift knob. Yeah. So those are all dealer installed, but your total price is going to be forty three five sixty three, which is really affordable, really for a mid sized truck nowadays. It's a heck of a truck. Yeah, I mean it comes with lift and tires already. That's crazy. Right. I mean that's that's pretty good, and this thing gets eighteen city twenty two highway with that three point five liter. And this thing rides so smooth. Oh yeah, with the, bigger tires. The and... ride, it's you can't even tell that it's got the terror grapplers on there can't even tell it's lifted oh no not and even then, any road noise right yeah no road noise i mean granted they don't really stick out too far but they're still well, a, still a little bit tire. more aggressive i mean this is a really <laughs> aggressive look going for this truck right now i absolutely love it pop the hood pop the hood let's go yeah all right guys so let's check under the hood god that's a heavy hood jesus all right wasn't expecting that toyota all right hang on quick little note Install hydraulic shocks on this hood. That's that's something I'm gonna recommend straightforward. This thing is heavy, all right? This <laughs> is this is gonna be the first con of this video right here. This hood is heavy. Let me feel it. All right. It can't be that bad. 
Holy! <laughs> that's a heavy hood. That is. That's that's a real heavy hood. So yeah, Toyota. First, first what are you first, doing with this? We don't need first, this. First things first. Install <laughs> install hydraulic. The st- only con of this truck is that right there. I I love this truck, but please, that's a heavy hood. That <laughs> is. Put some shocks on here. All right, guys. So this is the 3.5 liter V6. Now this has. Damn, I forgot. I just I just read it. I did my homework. You- yeah, so you have your TRD air filter installed in there. This has 278 horsepower with 265 foot-pounds of torque. Are you sure? Double positive. All right, guys, so like I said, this gets 18 miles to the gallon in the city and 22 on the highway. A very capable truck indeed. This takes 020 oil for those interested. Whoa. Yeah. That's interesting. Most Toyotas do take 020 nowadays. A lot of V8s, actually. All your GM vehicles, all the GM 53s take 020 now, too. Crazy. We're out of time. 530 is becoming obsolete. It's time to be alive. Yeah. Is that a you. QR code under the hood? Of course. What? It's in the world. <laughs> Where? Where that? Right there. On the brakes or whatever. Oh. Well, yeah, of course. You know, you got to have your QR code. I mean, come on now. If you don't know what you're doing, you just scan that QR code. That's right. Yes. That's how That's how us mechanics do work now. Oh, yeah. You just scan it. You're dang that's right. It. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's check out the interior. That's heavy. All right, guys. But first... I don't know if this camera's cutting it out too well. I think we might need something new. Okay. So Best Buy is right there. And oh, look. All right, guys. <laughs> Got the new camera. Hero okay. 5 with the remote and uh I didn't think you were going to buy that. Of course. You know, why did we drive over there? Why'd you walk all the way from here? Because. To right there. Come on. It's a GoPro. That's why. You didn't get the Hero 6? What do you mean? Oh, I didn't get the Hero <laughs> 6. <laughs> yeah, that's a heck of a deal, though, right now. $299. $299 for the Hero 5 plus the remote. So that is going to be awesome. Wait, what was that right there? That, that is a head mount for the uh, POVs that we oh. are going to be doing now. And with this, expect some vlogs from us now because we will be vlogging with this. I, I got to buy one of these now too. Yeah, I guess we're going to have to buy two. Yeah, I guess we'll buy two. Today's the day of impulse buying, I guess. You're dang right. All right, guys. So here we have the interior of the Tacoma. Now, this interior is actually very, very nice quality for an SR5 trim. We have these nice cloth and in black and a brown mesh kind of interior. Very, very nice. And, uh, drives like a dream. We have a lot of really cool features on here, like I was saying before, that are new. Uh, we have the safety sense. So we have the automatic uh, collision warning for when a vehicle's in front of you. And we also have the lane keep assist. It will notify you if you're going in and out or of the lane. Lots of, lots of features on the Tacoma. This truck is great to drive. Super, super comfortable. Visibility is phenomenal. And it is like no other. I truly enjoy every bit of the Tacoma and what it is. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Now, this is the TRD shifter we mentioned before. Oh, this thing is super sleek, super nice feeling in the hand. You also have your manual shifting mode, which is really cool. Now this does go to 6,000 RPM and has a top speed on the speedometer anyway of 140 miles an hour. I don't know that you can entirely do that, but I mean, you can definitely try, I guess. To you your might. heart's desire. Oh, look, it's an old Tacoma. Brother. How Bro- times have changed. Broke his neck. They have quite a bit of power. You can definitely, definitely feel it. That's also a Tacoma. <laughs> oh, how 
Tacomas are different for everybody. Let me tell you, <laughs> you can make the, the Tacoma anything you want it to be. That's what's great. And uh, we did purchase a GoPro Hero 5. Like I said earlier, it's dead. Yeah, it, it doesn't come charged, unfortunately. So we will be using that from now on for the most part. Uh, we will be doing some vlogs for you guys. Uh, hopefully, do whatever you guys want to do. Uh, we will try to please what you want. I mean, it's all about you guys. Oh. Look at this brown. Let me tell you, this brown mesh is really nice. It's like not leather, but it's... No, but it's... It's like something. I don't know. It's a nice material. It's like all over the door. Yeah, I know. It's everywhere. Dashed back there. It's stitched in the seats to match. Right. It's really There's nice. Floor mats. Of course. Big back seat. We also have another really cool feature. Oh, yeah. The sliding rear window. Sliding rear window. There we go. It's with the cabin breathe a little bit. Oh, yeah. Driving. Unfortunately, we're going to... Whoa. We're, that was a Type R flying that was by. That a Type R. But we're going to leave that closed because it's pretty... This is five degrees. Pretty nipply outside. Nipply? Nipply. This is really nice. Four wheel drive, automatic LSD, trash control, all I the good stuff. LS. <laughs> LSD is nice. Not the kind you're thinking we of. We also like the shortest light in the world. This is correct. To go through. This light is amazingly short, but that's okay. This truck is quite a pleasure to be in. I don't mind. Dang right. But uh, we have a really nice feel going on here in the center console area. The shifter's real nice, centrally located. We have a ton of cup holders in here. We got two in each door, two down here along with some storage space. And then you got another one up here with a little coin slot or another little storage space. You have a handbrake on a truck, which is awesome. But you won't throw it around this curb. You dang right. Brand new truck. I ain't trying to get sued or something the hood looks so big oh yeah it's really not like like i mentioned before this truck is huge for a midsize like this is exceptionally larger than midsizes used to be like my truck like if you put our side by side this thing looks like a gigantic monster compared to mine and that's I mean, just that's the times we're at mid-sized trucks are full-sized to what we know and full-size are just behemoths yeah, like, but it's still not that bad, though. No, I mean, it's still not bad. Like, I mean, this isn't unbearable in any way. Like, this is very comfortable to drive. I don't feel like I overshadow everyone. Like, I mean, we're on pretty, we're on a pretty par level with this Pathfinder in front of us. So, I mean. But then we were, you know, just as tall as that F-150. Right. That just went by. Right. Like. It's, it's pretty crazy. I do thoroughly enjoy driving this. I love the Tacoma. I really do. This thing takes corners like a beaut. Let me tell you. It doesn't even feel like you're driving a lifted truck. Not at all. I mean, granted, this isn't as lifted as some people are going to say, oh, that's you know, that's not lifted. Six inch lift with 35s is lifted. Nah, listen. This this is technically lifted. Come on by, Maxima. I think Maxima just cut Crazy us off people. here. Jesus. This ain't even our truck. Let me tell you. This thing is so much fun to drive. We want to give a huge shout out again to Wise Johnson Toyota here for letting us use this 2018 Tacoma. We always love what you guys do. Toyota is such a great company nowadays. Everything is becoming just absolutely incredible in the vehicle world. And uh, I mean, what more can we say? It's, it's amazing. You do have automatic lights in here. I mean, this is for a base well, model. We'd have automatic lights. Well, yeah, I mean, but you know, in, well, in a because... base model in a sense, you know, this is a very advanced. But dang, that's a lifted that's Tundra. That's a Tundra. There's another Tacoma. Yeah, that's what's up. But you know, for a base model of terms, this definitely has a plethora of options that many people will enjoy. And you don't have to break the bank for it either. I mean, this truck before all the dealer installed options was 35,000. I mean, the base model started at 24000 but this is definitely quite the truck for not spending fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 like your conventional full-sized. Oh, yeah. You definitely get the money's worth out of this truck. Now, this has all the safety, of course, as well. But right before we take this back, this has a ton of safety features, five-star ratings everywhere, rollover, 
side impact, front impact, rear impact, everything. Super, super safe. Turning radius is fantastic. Overall, I absolutely love this truck and I hope they continue to do just as well. So with that being said, guys, we hope you enjoyed this review and we will catch you guys later. All right, guys, we also want to mention the fact that this actually comes with a GoPro Hero mount, which is really cool for our case, but uh, you can record some off-road clips, you know, your POV. Toyota really has you covered, and that is one of the coolest features I have ever seen here on any modern vehicle. So huge props to Toyota for that. Is that why we bought a GoPro? Maybe. <laughs>